I'm Tom Freiberg reporting for Waterworld TV here at IFAT in Munich, Germany. Please say I'm joined by Stefano Salvatore, who is from Salzness Filter. Stefano, good to see you. Good to see you. Thank you for joining us here. No problem. So, uh, Stefano, I want to kick straight in with a more strategic question. And kind of where, as a company, you see the future of really the primary wastewater treatment market in Europe? I would say Europe, as you know, is more than 30 countries. Each country has a different driver. And the, dri the, the markets are driven by different needs. Uh, for example, we have uh, the Netherlands driven by cellulose recovery, which is a driver for primary. Uh, UK is asset management, you know, stressed infrastructure. Uh, the France and Italy is mostly for biogas, actually. So there is a lot, this is really a patchwork of uh, needs into the countries, driven, all of those driven on top of it from uh, asset management. It's, it's, most of the time is uh, uh, urbanization, treatment plants built close to, uh, to existing cities that are now surrounding the, the plants. So we have no, no more, they have no more footprint available. So even when you look at the map globally, Europe seems quite a relatively small continent. There's still a fragmented a array of needs. But let's bring it down to the technology level. Yeah. And tell us about the filter behind us and really kind of the, the developments within that, if you will. Uh, I would say the, uh, the, the main value proposition for Salzness to, to municipalities is to, to do, we do uh, fine screening, primary treatment, uh, thickening, and when needed also the water the watering all together in one step and we do all this job with 90 percent less footprint which is a huge value for municipalities especially in europe where uh, where we don't have so much uh, land available yeah, yeah. for expanding plants that's that's our main th this technology is uh, uh, quite different from the other technologies like let's say our main competitor is the primary setter tank which is the very well known technology I would say that's a good technology but uh, uh, it takes a lot it needs a lot of land to do the same job so we do support uh, municipalities with a, a very uh, effective technology for upgrading and for expanding plants without any other land use. Now that 90% uh, reduction in footprint yeah. is a very enviable figure and I'm sure when you're talking to municipalities that's of interest but what about for the industrial markets? Industrial How does market, that translate over? Correct, correct. The, uh, the, the industrial market we have also not only the footprint and the, uh, land saving, we also have other uh, driver which we, are, we can uh, achieve better performances, for example, in uh, aquaculture and fish processing, which is our target number one now for industrial application, pulp and paper, and uh, last but not the least, the marine application with the cruise ships, uh, which is a huge market now. Uh, and again, the main uh, value for uh, the cruise ships is the uh, volume, the footprint. So if we do the same job in 90% less volume and footprint, then we save space for cruise ship. Yeah, yeah. so they they're trying to get maximum treatment yes. capacity out of a smaller, because yeah. space is premium. Yes, right, they can build up more cabins, for example. And sell yes. more places, right, yeah. Yes. So yes. what about, um, we've talked about cruise ships, agriculture, coming over from municipal level, but what about the future? Where, where do you see more markets and kind of growth for the company? I think the market is driven by, now actually in Europe, is driven by uh, the, that's a buzzword, which is circular economy. But the circular economy in our market mean, means two big uh, stuff. One is biogas uh, production. So we do help municipalities to, and we are doing a lot of R&D in that perspective uh, for, for enhancing the biogas production. And the other one is the cellulose recovery uh, for cellulose recovery for, for uh, producing byproducts. 
use it for the market for the in, in the in the circular economy mindset that's that's in this perspective we are in in uh, in a smart plant uh, uh, horizon 2020 european project we are developing uh, a lot of application there and uh, i think uh, that's that's the future for 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 salsness and rotating belt filter technology